I go by the name Benjamin. I love it when we said the youth. Because from our childhood, we were taught knowledge. And uh, knowledge is not much here in Ama. Even though we are not 18 years, some of us are not 18 years. But he has a zeal to work. Now, if we have online work, be there. Yeah. Now, we have a PayPal account. The PayPal account is checking that Gambia has access to PayPal account. Hey, Ghana. Let's check Gambia. Okay, okay, good. What can I say? I'm sorry, 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 I'm and the people are just less than 10 percent. Gambia is too many of people. So they have access to PayPal accounts. And yes, I'm here. And how are you going to do it? How are you going to help us with our sporting bets? Is that what I'm And two, with our PayPal and bank accounts. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Please be seated, please, please. First of all, I would like to thank the opinion makers, some of the kings and the chiefs, of this particular region I hear and I want to acknowledge them. I want to thank them for coming. I I would like to thank Dasibre Boateng the third for also receiving me in the palace this morning with his chiefs. And let me use this opportunity to also thank the Metropolitan, the people of Koforidia, Cove Town. You're very welcoming. Thank you. And I usually don't do this, but I want to say thank you to my wife <laughs> for, for just standing by me. Thank you very much. You've been a great woman. And of course, all the new force team and my good friend Nana Kwame, who is like my brother. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, Koforidia, are you in the house? Are you here? I still don't feel the energy. You know, you know, I want to say something, right? The power of Ghana's modern youth is immeasurable. It cannot be compared. It cannot be sized. It must be God's power that has woken up in the youth of this country. And everywhere I've been, in all of these regions, I can feel it. I feel the energy. I feel the new people. This young man here, I recognize him. SRC, come give me a shake. It's good to see you again. David, it's good to see you. Um, I'm seeing some familiar faces here, some young people. And I want to say this, that I am here to serve the younger generation of this country. But I'm also here to learn from the older generation of this country. You know, they say the greatest people in this world learn from the greatest people's greatest mistakes. And therefore, I think there is so much we can learn about our history of governance, of politics, and our historic leaders. Now, before 
and the purpose why I'm here. I would like to tell you that there are two sides of me. There is Nana Kwame Bediako, and then there is Freedom Jacob Caesar. I want the crowd to choose one. Which of the character do you want to hear from today? Cheddar? Well, I, I would like to tell you what Cheddar means. Cheddar means money. And and um, I, I want to know which one do you want more? Sika, Upeska. That is one. All right. The second part is I want to know do you want us to have this conversation in English or in Chi? Tree. 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 All right, Rebecca Tree. Let me first start. Sir, Koforidia in 1875 was established by the colonials of Ashanti. And the higher Ashanti Maimunso. The history of the Ashantis. Nayane Oha. Baby Ogana Biano. Yay, and I'll be who you hold the most. And Koforidia. Koforidia. Messi Koforidia. 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 I'm mindful for us, sorry. Because, say, a cassay a deep. Your culture. Your cassay a deep. Mr. Mo, my chosen person make a tree. I'm a frafra. I'm a frafra. Okay. All right. Last year, last year. I took one of the biggest decisions in my life. And decisions is probably one of the most powerful things that we need to learn about as human beings. Now, a bit more hard, I want to me and take a decision. I want to say, easy. Say, oh, sorry, and I know I take a decision. I want to say, 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 say, hey, easy, sad, yeah. Koye. Na decision I'm taking here, no me person me who omo amo amo who say, aye akukudro, ebi ne peja me, ema me jina me naso, ena me say, I am ready, I am ready, ready to build a new nation, ready to build a country, ready to bring hope to the hopeless ready to create wealth for the poor ready to review a constitution that has undermined our knowledge and our privilege for many decades i stood up and i said i am ready and so the new force was birthed now the new force minim said you know, politics na you name, but you name leadership. Now, the difference between the two, no, you person there, me change the one sana you call into the listening talk. Say, say, a cast a politician, near cast a leader. A politician has a program, he lives by the program. When himself a court region, say, he say, no, be here, when he win, no, be here, but a true leader. They just have a purpose or they have a vision so they don't need they don't live by program when you look at a politician he wants to be elected to become a president but when you look at a real leader he wants to build a nation he wants to uplift humanity he wants to invest in his country and his people Misha, a politician will come with a promise 
But the leader does not need to promise you. Because he already knows that he has a purpose. That you will benefit from that purpose. And I am that leader. I have a purpose. I have a vision. To build a nation. So we can all start all over again. And build ourselves again. This country has been waiting for a leader. But all this time, this country has been governed by a politician. So I realized that our presidents in the past, they have come from lawyers, they have come from doctors, and many professions that you need a lot of degrees to acquire before you become a lawyer or a doctor. But what our leader hasn't come from yet is a businessman who is a wealth builder. Someone that knows how to create money. Someone that knows how to correct money. I am here today. I am here. And I want to tell you something. That I am not scared to lose. And I have no fear to fail. But then when you fail, you learn. I am ready to learn. And you know the only time you learn, the best time to learn is when you're wrong. And I realize that we as a country will be wrong to sit down and watch leaders leading us astray, leading us to paths, leading us into valleys that we cannot come out of. I live in a country that in the past two weeks that I have been going through this listening tour, I have realized that 70% of this country are jobless and I've only covered 11 regions. This cannot happen. This cannot happen. We don't have a future as a country if 70% in 11 regions are jobless. And then the 10% are women who have invested in their children so they can come and take care of them only to find out that after their investment there were no jobs for these children so the investment has also gone into the drainage it's gone because now the 25 year old young man who has a lot of potential to change this country to become successful to become an entrepreneur is now living with his mother and the mother is feeding the child now not only that but the husband of this mother, Obatai, Onunso Walusu Nejuma, and she say no, Obano, and I offer a member me. Come on, let's give it up for the women of this country. They have, they have held us down. They have held us down, and that is the reason why I believe that when God puts us in power, we should uplift our women. We should put them in the best positions with us. Some of them should become the vice presidents. Because I go to the market and I can see the women selling all the food that we eat. I can see them in the farm. I can see them doing so much. But we have nothing for them. And it's the same thing. And it's the same thing to do with our youth. This 70% of people looking for jobs are maybe from 16 years old to 40 years old they don't have jobs well I want to tell you this the new force came here to introduce industrialization within all the regions that will become the next biggest industrial revolution that will change this nation it's a new foundation I have found a way I have found a method to get you the job you're looking for I have found you the ways to make you become successful I have found you the ways to look after your mothers your fathers and your family this is what I'm here to do now 
Before say, before say, me to an amount. Please, please, please sit down. Let's be, let's listen, and we're gonna have the chances to ask questions. Let's interact. I know the jama and everything is a nice thing, but in life sometimes you have to remember that the same letters that is spelling listen when you turn it backwards is the same letters that say silent. You need to listen to the voice in your head. Don't follow the noise. Okay? The noise is not going to pay you. Follow the voice. Skip the noise. Obey the voice. The voice is powerful. The voice is telling you to do it. But your heart is telling you you can't do it. Because you're scared. But I came here to leave you with one thing that is stronger than fear. And that is hope. So I need you to pay attention and listen carefully. And I want you to interact with me. I want you to ask me questions. I want you to challenge me. I want you to ask me how am I going to do what I said I'm going to do to change your life. Yes, changing your life changes my life too. It's a win-win situation for all of us. Whatever I can do to add value to you, I will become globally successful for doing that. I will be acknowledged. I will have a legacy that will live even after my life. That is my investment. My investment is not just the houses I've built, the hotels, the landmarks, the cars, and the clothes. They're worth nothing to me. What is really valuable to me is the value I can add to society. It's what I can change nature to be. And it's what I can add to this world before I leave. For me, that is my responsibility. It's a social responsibility. And I want you to be with me to do that because I cannot do it on my own. And therefore, your energy, your concentration, your determination, your belief, when we bring it all together, do you know the force that is in this room? Do you feel how many minds are coming together and spirits when we're moving with the universe behind us? The world will hear of us. Imagine Ghana will be the next country that the whole Africa would have to follow. Just imagine, just picture that why I ask myself that Ghana is the first country to have gained their independence in the South Sahara of Africa. Why is it that we're becoming the last country that is losing their economy, that is losing their gold, that is losing their cocoa, that is losing the people? We've lost our timber, now we're losing our youth. They're running away. I think Ghana is on the way to fail, but this would not happen because this very moment, Ghana is having 74.9% of 0 to 45 years youth, the strongest army in the West Africa right now. We are 75%. We are below 45. We have energy. We are the strongest resource right now. When you go to Nigeria, you go to Ivory Coast, and you count, and you lead, and you check. All our resources together. That makes the cheddar. It's a lot of money. It's a lot of value. It's too much for all of us. So I had to use 30 minutes to warm you up. But why am I here? I'm here for the listening tour. The new force. It's a movement. It's a movement that is here to stay. It's a movement that is here to change lives. Babs, how are you? It's a movement that is gonna change the mindset of Africans, the mentality of Africans. Because this movement stands for a mentality. And I'm here because I want to replace the mentality that we have neglected and chosen nationality. Please, your mentality is important than your nationality. Please, somebody help me say this. Your mentality is more important than your nationality.
I want to repeat it again. Because I don't think you've understood how deep what I'm saying is. That your mentality is more powerful. It's stronger than your nationality. The country has chosen our nationality over everything. Everybody is either I'm from Ashanti or Koforidia or I'm, I'm a Voltarian. And so if you're looking for a job, you have to be a Voltarian or you have to pay money before. Come on. We're choosing where we are from instead of using our mentality to help each other and to build each other. Who got us into this mess? Is it our colonial masters? Was it our fathers? Now look at us. You can choose someone from Ashanti, someone from Kowu, someone from Ewe, go and choose someone from Nigeria, go and choose someone from England, and they're all black. Even choose someone from America, put them in a plane, and send them to China, and ask a thousand Chinese men, who are these people? He's not going to know you're from Koforidia. He's not going to know you're Ashanti. He's just going to say they're black and they're Africans. He will not even know the difference between a Ghanaian and a Nigerian. Which means the mentality of standing for a black color of an African is more important than the choice of money that you want to make for your pocket. Because the value you can give to humanity would become the wealth that can never be measured. And if we start to put values in our people, we are going to grow rapidly. I am here to do that. God has blessed me with a lot of riches. He has blessed me with grace. He has given me wealth. He has given me cars that my wife will tell you I haven't seen some of them for eight months. It's your dream car. I forget that I have it. I forget that I have it. But that's not what I'm here to talk about. I am saying that with all of these things, there is no much use for it. You will probably have the best use for it, but you don't know how to get it. And when I get it, that's when I realize that the way I used to get the car is the same way I live my life every day. I work from 8 o'clock to 8 o'clock every day. So I don't even have time to drive it. I am becoming a slave to my own wealth. But I'm not here to be a slave to money. I am here to serve humanity, human beings. I think that's something God will respect me even when I die. That's my value. So after going to Tamale, I went to Boliga. After Boliga, I went to Goso. I went to Seshuyaso. I went to Techiman. I went to Sunyane. I went to Ashanti region. I went to Western region. I went to Central region. I went to Volta region. Now I'm in Koforidia, the Eastern region. And I'm here to start with you. The listening tour. You see, what makes me very different from the other leaders is that they only went to the regions to come and make yourself present and create awareness for your vote. No, I came to find out about the culture, about the people, and to listen to the people. And therefore, we're going to start the listening tour, and we're going to take five questions from people, and I'm going to answer it. We're going to interact.
and a waha in this region, look at the south and a vote as well. As for you, many have. I said, I'm not independent. And if I a two American family check airplane to my own, I'm just 41 years old. As for you, I'm not a certain age. It's a mess now. Me, you, the minister, independent candidates, no. We are going to take over Ghana. Never get to go home. Question first because uh, the question, no, I am your son, and your one, and the Ebia Yensha here from a Juma side. The new force has embarked on a journey to introduce industrialization, a foundation that will build this nation. Now, I would like to explain that further. So, what is industrialization going to do for this country? Our first policy is to create 16 revolutional industrial 16 regional industrialization now this revolutionary industrialization i bet you will come on at the opportunity and me decided some of you know me who said 15 regions in this country is non-active to send you okay now a crap in a year juma me i can you know and yeah juma over corner now bro need to be a factory yes a few things back up no, the ni nipa baye se tena omo ani majuma na ngata no wapfa ni pa ebi a hundred. And I walk in so kofuridi aye ninety something thousand voters, which means you have about hundred and fifty to two hundred thousand people. And he na ne nine a hundred and ninety nine thousand no makano. I bet then omo ni majuma. It's because we have not trained our people with industrialization. I repeat it again. This is the most important thing in our lives right now. Uko America, na me pamuchawa. Interesting to see America industrialization. Interesting to see China industrialization. Interesting to see Dubai industrialization. England industrialization. Oba Africa, debio. Omusi omumpene. This is omusi omumpene. Uni madikrontia. Me ba be chere chere mukakra. Oshé onze me answer your questions ni tu ni njina. The 15 regions and the job. Now, we share to say your regions now. What you mean, sir? The dual poly nankasa, a boom, my way. No, I'm not saying here, no, a war region more because as so far years, be a person with this cacu to be brown or he ain't no a talk or chromoti ain't he a nunti crano, a mano, ye nyan si or be president or be dinti a man nankasano, ye nyan si. And so, Ukwa Brochia, Uko England, London, a Yomo capital town. And so, through Manchester, Ube who Manchester United or Ube who Manchester City or Ube who factories or Ube who normal or and also Air Coso, 
uko Liverpool a eno so koso uko ko mu kro ni nyina ba bie ni ho a o maye ne tse ni agana aye ye regency enti problem no eno no no se obi ka kero se anything else is going to save you a me se oboa oko bobu si 100 billion kra fra bontin ba you may say any two years crap you cannot a best son because your chair was gone at 33 million so what will be a thousand dollars 100 billion 33 million no see your child may say will be a thousand dollars so the hundred billion crab and a thousand dollars no one month no no as a and you know see any of the book and you see my name no sir industrialization idea juma beba now a young crop were free low income middle income so we can have a middle income country. That is when the problem will be solved. A hono and a woman who says the factory is 10 and now 15 and the work of for you. Now a many pair juma over 100,000. No, be an abacacho say yo. A coin now bones and one casano. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because a one yet is kind of fossil. O be a no one yet did you. And he a coin in your ano. A bay yet, but a coin as a okay. Let me add something to it, and then we want him to be able to save you for later. Say, yeah, they put a big bag, my mu. Yeah, they be back, my say. Yeah, they be back of for you, dear. Yeah, they be back. Yeah, connectivity be a voter. And you may just ask question later. Hey, be a, we be able to na ya kumu dipa, Mister Okoso. Let us say, your friend and I. Let us say, Mister Okoso. Politicians, we are too many to be a. Or what to proceed, dear. Passami <laughs> Okay, thank you. Um, I will take my time and answer. And so I would like, I would like to answer. Me pesa, me pesa me answer. Eh, Papa ya, or baby, or baby, say three questions. See. I was say politicians, or man what day? Now, when you are going we are no man why no 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 no. Or say cards and be say, see see I would not mention. Now say what you never know. Me ya kunya ne suit na. Me ba or me see jiran change jiran change. Pamu cho. Mung kanjere papa ne say. Mindi president kurano. Bodyguards di mechi. Police for di mechi. A dumb di mechi. And so men sani pamu. Men sani pamu. Na me pesu o hunse. Sa politicians na o ka o muwa semeno. I am not one. I am a leader. I am a risen leader. Na me pesu papa inso me pesu me katre ni se. Politicians na o hu o muno. Na o mu o mu bibi di dada na. Ah? Na o mu si si o mu ndai bibi dada na. Na o mu tu to o mu kasi bia bia dada na. Na America for any Europeans for sure o mu na. Ah, na inti adia papa ikeni miti na sepa ba adia me pesu ubi anzo huni se wani nda ho because who who difference no so who difference na ubeti asiye se akurebi anjamia shana wanyani sikaiwe no 
An kame ti makoti na Miami ni biye disika ni biye tribute ni bino. An kame ti makoti na Dubai. Aye misi kaka kocha shaho se Ghana ni amu yeni na anamisremo we di mini time. Na me Jessica na semno atunche. Me Jai enjuma semno atunche. Na ma sorry se. Adi a yeni ni yeno me ba be kurano. This is the leadership you should be looking for. That is the decision you need to take that you're not taking right. And Tina, make sure here with our conversation, no, make us say decision is important. Because how can we decide to choose a president or a minister who is coming to build house for us? A minister for works and housing. Ne ebia as a secura won to be that no akasu will be si fiesi so. Ah? Uko fa president. Now on one kasano. Onye ni business bida. Onim sika sevi. No onim sika kura. Now the hundred billion. The thirty three million people are shining sa. Se no ane se no ane se yeshi kosa. Ni ubi ya pebi ome fa. Favors. Na family. Ebi ya ne yiri ma minu ya. Inti wu jiwe. Mi kunu papa ba. Onsu jiwe. Mi ofa si enzo. Ni girlfriend ni onsu jiwe. Na ye chiche kosa. Na mu mu thirty three million na kano. Mugu ho. Na mu chen. And no, and I make us a money daho. We should not choose politicians like that to lead us. And then after we turn around to complain. Who is the government? The government is us. We are the one that make the government become a government. Without us deciding that the government should come to power, there will be no government. And today I am here to tell the youth of this modern Ghana that your power is not measured. You are entitled to put any leader in a position and you will be entitled to bring that leader down. That is your power. You should not exchange it for anything. I hope you're in there somewhere and I hope you can hear me that I am not a politician. I am a risen leader and you will witness the history of this modern new Ghana, new generation, new leadership, new everything from the new force. We will use force to change everything with the forces of the universe and we will not forgo our people or our country. Now I'm not here to tell you any promises. I have an aim and I have a purpose. And as you've already witnessed, since I was 20 years old, and I said that I'm going to triple and quadruple and multiply my millions, my mind has been there, and I've proved to you already. Go on the internet, Google me now, and ask the computer, who is this guy? You can choose not to give me the country, but you can trust and be rest assured that in 10 years, you might Google who owns Ghana. I would have bought it. Because I've given you the chance that let's own it together. If you refuse, you can do anything. I will go behind, I will work so hard, and I will come and buy it. Because me ma it will be in Chamisika Mame. If I'm your leader, I will not a white man print your money for you before you eat. I don't know if you come here. Koti ya chwa ya mbiya manetwe sika abra ya ansani ya didi. Na uko bro ni kuro ma uube ti mechwa ni sika ya komano. Uko ya godi ya odi ano. Uni right ya ube chwe sika ya nidi ya komano. And so onuwe nya right. So odi chwe sika ama on. Na onuwa nka sasu na o supporti sa politicians ya. Omudi muna mkwa ya wezui. Ufi se mi nimsu omudi omudi na omudi. It's because of the interest that they have in your country. Recently, we've had about 120,000 kids, youth, travel this year. Omo kwa abrochini, abrochio omo si omo hospitals ebi, omo si omo banks ebi, omo si omo universities ebi, omo si omo parliament, omo wo a good democratic system, omo yinya mo influ biya ho. Na afi nkani panu komo for ma kwa yadeng, because we unhu omo sun faswa, wabe fa omo, o chira o se ni panu su omo faswa, because o ni bi biya ensu ni panu o yinya omo, enti se o ye o ni pa waga na ha. Ni inti mi nyeshi mo mo ni inti mi fomo nyeshi ya ubi ba ba fomo, and that is what is happening. That is what is happening. Thank you. Please.
I go by the name Benjamin. I love it when you said the youth. Because from our childhood, we were taught knowledge. And uh, knowledge is not much here in Ama. Even though we are not 18 years, some of us are not 18 years, but he has a zeal to work. Now, if we have online work, be there, yeah. Now, since we have PayPal account, the PayPal account is checking that Gambia has access to PayPal account. Hey, Ghana, let's check Gambia. Okay, okay, good. What can I do? I'm trying to find that bank account. And he's not even 18 years. Why is it what happened? Come this man. Baby, come this. PayPal, and I was shocked. Gambia, Gambia, compared to Ghana, and yet thirty percent land of Ghana. And the people are just less than ten percent. Gambia is too many of people. Now, so they have access to PayPal account. And here, can you? We get some silence in the room, please. I'm sure that that woman was very patient, and I was watching her. There were four young people in front of her, but no one looked behind to see that maybe our mother first. That everybody wanted to talk about their problems, but they forgot that there were five men or five boys and one woman. Let this be a lesson that as young people and as much as you are screaming the youth, the youth, the youth, we should look at our mothers. They are, they are struggling. They are suffering for us. It's so bad time in the baby. Because I am a mom, 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 I am a mom
obi anhwe na chi obi ahwe na nim but your past is supposed to be your teacher your present is supposed to be your gift but your future is supposed to be the gift and the teacher that has taught you about experience that will lead you to your future ti no ma bi wo ha ye hwe wo ye ma me mu ene ye papa mu a it shapes our future ti mi sremo aya na ma mamani akobochi all right let me go to this young man the young man i say paypal ye nya account o say I just want the 18 and send one your account. Now, some a young man, he can. There is centralization and decentralization. Aha, me chetro mu. Why? Centralization, no. Aye, the current government system, my wo yase. To say central bank, central headquarters, parliament, BBA, it was central. Into omo no omo controli BBA. It is a conditions, no. It is a D18 and send our account. It is a say, it is a say, account, and then so a central bank, no, and a license and send our Timania account, no. Decentralization, a computer life, technology. And no, dear, we could be a Facebook account. Who here saw my me and our papa, a baby, a catcher say yes and send a web. And once we'll be a Facebook account. Who could be an Instagram account? Who pay a Gmail? Obi at me yeni TV, e wo computer so. Na ono a yeni ya fe nse YouTube, ono a personal television. E no, e na ye the life of decentralization. Na se si a make say, the world and penny four, they are fighting against the decentralization. Omo mpe se ebe baso, because centralization life, you know, is the only life they know, and they don't want to give in. But en kuranso omo ba nso. Decentralization of Mutia. So, okay, a crabia say, own be account, or computer, so, and I say, onko a daimu, non could be a counter, or be choose a computer. No, I don't blame them, and only the warm, and no sooner answer on more. So, open so, who young coupons is here, onko, sorry, and could be a pastor, and say, who is God? Obis a Google, no, I could be sano, computer, no, any yammy, on one a chain, a bibia, and tis a, and crown more, we are seven dorsal. Nase to be a muni. Nase ye leaders and per se omube accept it. Se technology and the dear beko ye nim. And ye now mu ya bro. And to my leadership, I really consider technology as industrialization. I will give you an example. FIFA, se muni na munim FIFA. FIFA when your football association. FIFA is a media company. Yes, FIFA has industrial technology to broadcast one football match to four billion people. What is that? It's media. <laughs> and that's what has made them powerful. His secret tool is what? Technology and industrialization. That is what I'm preaching to all of you about. Now, the technology and industrialization he's worth 21 billion dollars because ene with the billboard back kusi kwa ho ni pa 1000 no mbe hu sa billboard na nkasa with the bad social media sisi ya ni pa 1 million no mbe hu enti the old ways no enye adwuma biem to say the new ways na mpenyufo no nso empese omo be ma enkra ne kwan na o ma chere ewiase ade e wo ma dwenim wo hwa america Omo mu ye ye nina ano bebre shasye efiti omo kura brim ni a Facebook yani dia ni a Instagram yani dia o shasye ni wodi twenty something eno o kodi forty onti min kani sika inti e yen kura na ya wahana e biya abain eni ya ma me mu ni ya papa mu a stop e yen from ni ebe ye se me di na me ya soft onti e se onso ye soft ana se me ya lawyer onti e se onso ye lawyer. And uh, Bibia na omo de eko da kana we yenso yentimin kasa because the new Bibia or homaye. Today I want to tell you that you have a unifier, someone that stands between you and the elders of this country, someone that understands your problem better than the elders, someone that can compromise 
with the elders of this country and negotiate on your behalf. So your destiny will be prevailed. Thank you. Now, the next person question. Now, now I, I, I say, what is my ego drive to be a president? Now, as long as I'm five. Uh -huh. Five years, we will come to that. Now, what is my ego drive to be a president? Who said I just want to be a president? No, it's the stop. It's just one stop along the way. If you were to ask me, what is my destiny? What is my vision? Where do I want to be? I want to become an emperor of the continent. I want to be historically remembered. A legacy. A leadership that has never happened on this continent. I am in I'm aligned with thinkers like David. Like King Solomon was my mentor when I was growing up. I love this man because he feeds 2,000 people every night. And he know that. Let's can it more. I don't know but I still like him. <laughs> he's my, he's my, uh, one of my greatest mentors. And I think, sir, Africa at some point would need one voice. At some point, Africa would need one currency. At some point, Africa would need one leadership. Just like how the sheikhs of the Emirates have started a revolutionary development amongst themselves. It doesn't mean that there are no other leaders. They still have leaders. But there's one of them that started something that has sparked a revolution amongst all of them in the continent. And I think it all started with Sheikh Akhmatou. He learned from a guy called Lee Kuahin, the ex-ex-president of Singapore. Ah, or see Singapore BM. Or many years ago, I know soon free now. I know no soon Dubai. Or you mean follow up? No, we be. In the end, we share Arabs for a. We move up. We are Ronaldo. We are Messi. We are Agra. On beton. You are metro on what you say? On metro Bibio. On me say. On me Tony Pakeko. On me top stars. The most expensive stars. They command them. A day a busy city, so mumusi ship and in them room open your open be our mobile top because they've come together, they have created wealth among themselves, they have their own pipelines, they distribute their own power, they have energy city, and the whole world wants to go to their world. Let's clap for them because that's what we that's the kind of leadership that I'm going. That's what I want. But now, who can't himself a train we never see her who drew honor. See from Nepia, and you be a mobile woman, say six years, and I met me at the affix it and soon so be a be a be a industrial platforms, a be a be factories. I don't mind. The next person can come. I'll be the first one that steps down for someone who is more vigorous, more resilient to continue. Because me, Jenna, and me show when you are a dear me who only Muno just say you're ready, you want to do something, and when your time comes. We will give you the, 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 the chair also to continue from there. Because I can't say that you can transfer forever. Until you transfer your crown out to me, you will be ready. You will be ready. You will be ready. You will be ready. So my ego for being a president is just a transport to make sure that when I change my nation, when I add value to the society, then you will let me go after and clap for me so I can continue and become something bigger than just being a president. Thank you. Thank you. And before I go into these questions, I want to say something for the old woman that came here. And she really touched my heart. I think my wife was crying. And when I cry, my tears don't drop. I, it's my heart that bleeds. But I'll tell you why. Because I've gone past feeling any pain. You might see me as a young, successful man. But I've really been through the kind of pain that if God brought that upon you, maybe you'll probably jump from a cliff. And my heart bleeds for you. 
I feel your pain. And I know your problem. Inti, mame, e kwa imbi aso ame faso. Ama oba, eba, debi debi, e duya krona, enti mi enfifi aba paneno. Ama wahu se, wa amba hakwa, na matese, wa jina SIC enimu, for 14, 15 years. Ayi e juma adi a show ma. Ah, oma enti mi ame show. This is one of the biggest problem in the country. It's not fair. Say, a buying a beca say your educational system waha. Ah, your mouth degree cry now cross it to go. Obey who degree no value beam. I gonna happen as I say, yeah, Juma. And so degree no inya juya. Yes, yeah, Juma niho. And to me, say yes, camo, say yeah, day. Because crophobia waha. A bunko school that they be a made the madame for be example, despite. And so she. Or no, and as I said, mine be brave, a shiny style, or yeah, or yeah. If you answer what's media, yes, you can, or no crano, and the president told him, said, Dia, I'm up as what now. And tea school in here, but if you answer in here more, I as I say, you know, it's me, a giant now, so and the decision I make us as I see it take it by the end of this year. And you may be shabrint here, a yin, I shabre, as I say, as a sign man, near the sun, lost be a in dim wire. And this is why I'm mad. And this is why I'm mad. 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 I'm Nyankopon and Matnia Nakuma Swa dear Openo or Maninya Nani Jem Ranimu. Amen. Damasi. Thank you. Um I want to thank you for your question. Mammy answer the question because I mean sir. Now measure us here with the first one, no pot. Now uh pot tariff see at the back what any for cry or my muha a importation. And into a see a industrialization. Because you perceive a reverse situation, you know. Wash a hua. Ubiya kofa noma, no a coffee from China. No, a coffee free uh, Singapore. A coffee free free. Crow crow for frosso. No, the abba. Oh, the bands what? Government, no. Oh, no, a hono nyawa o miyaw. No, no, so. Oh, the abba. Shoot him. 50%. No, a jew sika. 
or juicy care we are now also work of tone product you know times five and now times ten now tono we are out to do a bs car now i said for jessica no with your commerce career sikarano only gana or china and i say oh crew for frosso in two by no now obit abr china or a manufacturer obinsu t abr korea or also or a manufacturer now you see Kenya, where your economy is now. Yes, sir. They are coming from far away. The banner is beton adiana. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. They are coming home. At the corner, Ukotono. Ebia is aluminium panels. On no be far of bauxite. And no cut turning into aluminium. And no sand turning into aluminium. And sand a Ukoto. This is the value of industrialization. It will stop all of this. Bibi aye can you know pot and a duty na one can say produce this and no man out of an taxes as MBA ni hobby and go for a moment a better free war and to one over than is a Chinese in an old Jew Sikano when I fed you Uji Nigeria for Sika Uji Jikro Kro for for different raw material near Odia I will jump a dear young couple on a dear mom and to a year day and I was a good child who got to free of being some and the Ghana cocoa China for the back of Kono at the cost of the Omono Mudia Coco. And on more way, I coco in Panyan to say, Oh, dear Cocona, and now a wa, a abano, and Fibium, Untimin Diabium. And Chebia, Obia, yes, a year number one as a number two coco producers, and Chebia, and any coco beam. Obia, who are wet up at the ano, and all the sea glass him, and all clony, and all tongue clone cocoa now. Adia yaudia. Gold ni yaudia. Obi abe hohru o krum. Ana wafa gold no. Ana wa ton di aji dollars. Ana dollars no. Wa chebi ama o sidisim. Ana gold na ankasa no. Enu na ye the value of the currency. Enti wu odu gold ni strengthen ni dollar no. Na wu jina hao pana chao se me pe dollar. Jimmy gold. Eye wama eye jujua na. So this is why the port has these issues. Because say I am sorting out industrialization. Papa ya some be complaining about tariffs. We are there, but you. Because you share industrialization as here with Chrome. Cars in your area, electric cars. No more be brave. Be you. We want to be work for you. Do you cry? No, I be you. No, I car. Ah, Ghana, Nigeria, for you. No, I South Africa, for you. No, I bet Because say you need that they fabricate. You need engine build it. You need no maybe I. It's a serious one. San Wajuma, a year in San Wajuma, a year industrial. A year in San Wajuma, a debut tree, and I see a DG tree. And San Wajuma, a year skills that would timidly done with cocoa to different things to cocoa butter, to uh, cocoa powder, to chocolate, to this, to that. Who go to know the buyer no more be brave with titanium or gas or the buyer energy. No, what's me and electricity? Not doom so doom so no one ever have a so amount. Aye, one kasa na wo gas, wo nyusu. So this is the problem. Now, may I answer our second question about education? Now, may I answer a kakra earlier on? Education, aye, yo kroma I say. Me ba, adi mi nu ena me pesa me di ba ba she school mu. Ba ko ye thinking subject. Because I me say ye mpe thinking. Ghana ye njuni ye mpe si ye be njuni. Se ye njuni ni eti ye ya anase bibi. Enti ye njuni for ochina pe. Ya dwene ya dwene ne ebedi ne ena ya wochena. Ya dwene hwe ya chimpo. Enti me pesa me dey thinking subject e ba be show school nim. Say enye Christopher Columbus pa na say say mu sue mo ho ade abroche fo asem. Na ya ntwaso na fe de Ghana man no chaase say akra akra no o chaase say o dwene because e dwene e hu hia. Yakopo an dwene kra nka won bow. Enti we have to think we have to be thinkatives not talkatives. Ya kasa Change any year journey. As I say, you're journey more. Now you're making sense. You're less, less noise, more thinking. And the normal over there, 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 I'm not be able to know one. I'm over here saying this year, you know, near Kranu. That is one. Two. Why should everybody educate themselves for 21 years so they can go and get a job? What happened to becoming a businessman? What happened to becoming an entrepreneur? What happened to become an industrialist? What is happening here? Why can't we be a government? Why did somebody left left Koforidia to go to America to go and study political science, come back and became our minister? 
without any global or local skills. Huh? How many are Geography ni subject 21 subject. After 21 years, no, mu kai ni amosi akra. Huh? So that is the kind of education. That is the kind of education. <laughs> that is the kind of education we have to give for our children. We have to let them learn about our resources and our minerals. So they are educated about what we have inherited. What belongs to us. And let them turn it around. Okay? Now the health. When you don't industrialize your country. And you want to build hospitals. What you're going to experience. I am going to demonstrate it for you. You're going to have a thousand people. Who will come to the hospital. In one hour. One go. 989 of them cannot pay. So the hospital, either so be huni pamo bo, na hospital no, a be go. And I say, obeka say a hospital a sekejumenti meshwa mo owu huni sika. Which one do you want? The two all is not good for us. The problem is that if you don't industrialize your country. So the average person can have a job. So they can have a middle income salary. How can they afford to cure themselves when they're sick? When you're giving somebody 2,000 cities and it costs 1,500 to fill their petrol tank. But that person has one wife and four kids. He has to pay their school fees. He has to pay the water bill. He has to pay electricity bill. All these bills does not know a Ghanaian and say, we are here no and away or sika and tiji way great nana. The same for everybody. So what is this? We are torturing our people. And I have to say, NCC hospitals, say you need industrial platforms. And we want to go for these things. It's going to be very difficult. In the white man's world, his development is integrated. When I say integration, say a low income house in Awaha, factory in Abese, two kilometers, hospital, mat, the whole place is integrated. In the mat area for 20 years, Nejuma for 20 years, only Lucia Jumano. Because in your shop, a factory, factory, so it's a for 50 years, machine, it's a 24 hours for 50 years. On the day, any energy, I just want to do it. I want to do it. Until say but yet your crew say the regions, you to me see hospitals, you to me near your roads, you to me educate your people. If the problem is that we are refusing to industrialize ourselves so we can create wealth and create jobs and make ourselves become a middle income country. That is any successful country in the world. That is how it's built. Thank you very much. Uh, my name is James Christine I'm a student in the um, I have a question. I personally seem to believe in the, the vision and then the strategic direction of the new force. And then um, from where I sit, I'm also looking at it this way. You, you make us understand that direction that you want us to go. Maybe individually or collectively, um, some of us here may have some sort of network that can support the cost of the new force, that agenda that we want to achieve. Because if eventually it's not achieved, maybe when the answer rightly said, you might go back there, come back, and then come and buy us, all of us, including the country. I do not want that to happen. So if personally, I'm speaking for myself, I am here to lead, and then I get to understand this, and I have a way I can support the, the movement. What what is the way forward? Thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Yeah. No. I saw a friend that knew me that, and I said the name. A businessman. And that you many a gym class are not doing. We start to follow up and then say, "Come on, we will do it for a long time." Not going to be there. Opportunity, I am here again. I am here now. Because when we say we fight for the youth, that you are a person in this country. Okay, 
Thank you very much. Please, I would answer the two questions. Uh, the first one was, yeah, the first one was about what can you do to help? A lot. First of all, join the movement, and it costs you nothing. It's zero percent. You just go online, da 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 da. da your name. And you're there. You're part of us. Secondly, preach the message. Educate the people. You see, I'm not asking for your vote as others would. I'm asking for your moral support. I'm asking that if you believe in the vision, then how can you share it? Maybe uh, the lady that came here might not have heard of New Force, but you will be the one that will help her to understand, to educate. So every moral support counts, okay? Thank you very much. And I'm sure my team is already in touch with you. There are people who are coming with ideas, things to help, everything. It's all appreciated. But we would, after this, we will start our donation. We want to raise money from Ghanaians. I want Ghanaians to be the ones that have helped for the campaign and to put us in power as new force. Because I want you to be part of the investment. So your commitment would become the determination for you not to lose, but to support till we win. And when I win, you win. Therefore, if you have invested in me, I will owe you. So that is the strategy. All of this is coming. The second person uh, was asking about what do I have for the youth when I come with great ideas. Yes, apart from the industrialization that will create jobs for the youth, I also have a strategy which is a capital seed to support all startup ideas from the youth sector. I will put some sort of capital, that same capital that the government is using to pay judgment debt. If you break $2 million down, it's 28 million Ghana. It can start business for 10,000 kids in this country. That out of that business, in just four years, some of the businesses will become more than the 2 million that started them off. Why would you not do this for your people? So I have that agenda. I have even bigger plans. My plans are not going to say. Because I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm going to say, yeah. So if you are working out, it's going to can help the youth and the country as a whole. So why not help the country now as well? Thank you. Let me answer the question in the first. Or say, if I'm wealthy, then why not help Ghana rather than becoming a president? You see, the mentality of this country it's very poor and it's very bad. And I'm not saying that she has a poor mentality, but she has adapted the mentality that she thinks that once you're rich, you should share your money. Sacha no na se menye sika no na makase mikro me hiamu nti me re sika no bremu na obi enya pepe 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 ene me nimu nyina one week time e be hia nyina because e be ka go this sika no so that's what the, that's the answer for you my dear me pacho don't look at someone that will come and use their money to convince you i think as a nation we're getting used to that o tembia na obi dia ban sika ba na abe dada ye je na ko ye sei ji we na ko ye sei why would him say at the cry this came away? Who's <laughs> suit? Who's <laughs> soon? Yes, yeah, a fat one and fat. And so, what it and see, mummy and dies, I don't know. Now, you're in Sierra Cape, in Sierra Cape, cry. Now, you see me in your abbey, I'm a minor, I am a madam. I said, Unya Aquena, Nakon, for second term. If you say 
without saying, for years now, is it enough for Ghanaians? That is my question. To have a change. Yeah. Yes, thank you. Nana, four years and also, but four years can make a change. I recall to make a sign and say, so what can say who see dying back? What? A bit me take you four years. So what can say who see dying hundred? At the same time, a bit me take you three years. Inti, aye how are we soon reno? Now me am a soon one who say, and conform we be di man isui. Two years, a bit me two amena. I'm so be see dying biasi so emba. A bit me so be say, I'm say ye emba, because. On ye be that and to unim how to measure the time with investment. A dear me a year investment and development. And I only don't invest on the land, I also invest in human beings. And I also develop human beings. And I've seen human grown and I've seen buildings grow. And I can see roads being expanded. And I can see waters connecting and new communities coming up. So the vision can bring you speed. And what we need is God's speed. So four years, somebody will try to use two years to go and follow debts and problems and who took money for this country and this, and then they use the other two years to try and campaign again. So they don't develop the people and they don't develop the country. For me, with four years, if my vision, my mission is to develop the people and to develop the country. I will start with a master plan that is a city sidescape in regions, and I will do all of the all of them simultaneously. <laughs> Multitasking. So I have just used only twelve days to travel eleven regions. Twelve days. And I've done so much research and I've reached already hundreds of thousands of people. If you add the social media and the media to it, it's millions of people. So you see, 12 days can do a lot. But it's how you see time, how you measure it, and how you push it. So definitely, I have four years, but I'm sure even the country will say, listen, my friend, give him 12 years. Give him the country. Yeah, because by four years, what they're going to see, even if I'm just a kingmaker and I negotiate with the government, in four years, I will still prove to the government that with all the government and the country together, I know how to make money than all of them. I will do it. And I will prove it to them that, you see, making money is hard thinking. It's not hard working. The people who are working hard the most, they're masons, they're farmers, all of these people, but they're not the ones who are selling the chocolates to the masses. So it's the one who are thinking hard that turned the cocoa into six different things. That thinker is the rich man. And I am one of those thinkers. Thank you. Thank you. From the gateway to have this morning at the palace, uh, from what we are experiencing now, it means we say uh, you have the wisdom, you have the understanding of the of the people of the country. She said, "Nyame, aye bibi, oh we di so we say we say we are the poor people." Now my problem has got to do with the system of nine or one. One, it's a youth. No, I can hear you say, "Nyame, you are dumb. You bet me a youth. No, ah, eh." Thank you. We have mafia in this country. How secured is the movement? And many so say you have been ready to for a bar. So the entire year before elimination for all taxes, for case we were not here in this chair. That is my number one. Wait here for the top. 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 Wait here for the top
three, it's about job, the security. You for no, in the eye. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, 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 um, opportunity come back once. So next time, when a leader or a politician appear here, you should be resource enough to put questions. Because look, let me stand up. Look, it it was time we removed the octogenarians, the septuagenarians. Those old old men. So it was time they left the sea. Look, go 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 to the next. Look at what is happening in the world. There is a, a, a wind of change blowing politically. All the old 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 are leaving the sea. So we have to erase them before they erase us because the youth are being used as a pawn. They come to you, pawn, the word T A W N. I don't mean P O R I. ourselves into the future. Let us meditate quietly, sober reflections. Let us look at the state, the nation. Let us look at the resources available to us. Let us look at the population. But let us look at the massive resources. Some of the resources have not even been discovered yet. Are we going to allow the old politicians to sell our future. No. Please, let us think. Critical thinking. Please, let us raise both them out. Any old man who comes to the political scene must be voted out. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I think, I think well, he's answered some of the questions, but the first one is very important. That they would use rough tactics. As you see, when the new force started, we don't have rough tactics, but we have smooth strategies. We started by introducing you to a mask. You started looking for us, you found us. Our first spokesperson was a foreigner. You started talking about it. Our first event, was the convention of four great leaders from four different countries in Africa that not even the president of Ghana, Nigeria, and Togo, when you put them together, they cannot bring those four people here. We brought them. So I know that my investment is in the youth. And I want to say it here, that whatever tactics that is coming, you are my answer. You are my hope. Your voice is going to rise up. I am indoctrinating the force into the people of this nation. So come December or come November, if they try just to take the youth out like what our brother is saying, the youth will arise again. They have to ask the leaders that we have to be fair. And then they are also going to be legal support. That even if we have to take EC to court to make this whole country stand still until the right thing is done, we will do it. Because if we don't, they are taking us for a ride. And if they are stopping me and you think I'm intelligent and smart, please, the next six that is coming is going to be the same thing. Which means we will never get out of this trouble. This year, we are getting out of this 
trouble. And so etwa. And my security, I think that it's it's you people too. Listen, don't kill yours. You see, the most leaders from our society, black people, they were killed by black people. But somebody else behind the black person fixed it. He turned you to a Judas. Now, you see how many of us have killed our own. From Malcolm X to Martin Luther to Kwame Nkrumah to even Bob Marley said that how long would they stand and watch our people get killed whilst we stand and watch? How long should we stand and watch our prophets get killed whilst we stand and watch? We need to change that. Gaddafi was one of my favorite people. They took him out. His own people. I think that the time has come that we stop this. This is a new revolution. This is a new force. There are some bodies that is like spirits. God has sent us here for a purpose. You want to know about my life? How many people tried to kill me? How many people tried to take me off? And I, I'm even acting like I haven't seen the devil. But I can see him right in front of me. I can tell a killer by the look of their eyebrow. I am coming like David. That anybody that wants to be their Goliath, they're welcome. Because when God prepares you to go for war, he doesn't give you knives. He doesn't give you guns. But he gives you brains. He gives you grace. He gives you a lot of things. And even when you're not there, you become the case study for how humanity should be prevailed and should move on. So I believe that with your support, your belief, and your spirit behind me, I'm protected. You are my security. Thank you. Okay, uh, I also work at Apostle Zion. I repair Sierra. Okay. okay. Uh, my question is, what are you going to do for we, the workers at Apostle Zion? Because as a youth, after say what's new at Jumeirah, we can go to the shop at Apostle Zion. Shops at Apostle Zion are very expensive. No government um, shops are on There is nothing like that. What is your question? So my question is, what are you going to do for people in Apostle Zion? Thank you. Okay. All right, and then the other man asks culture. So make sure you add. No, it's, it's added. Culture policy. You can sit down. Please wait. Let me answer the question. Please, Abu Sokai is a spare pass place. Listen, we're already talking about duties. The duties are very expensive. All of these things. You know, we keep importing cars. The cars are way too many. They're not even fitting on our roads anymore. I believe in industrialization, and I think that the future of the people of Abu Sokai is because they can fabricate the steels of the same spare parts that they are bringing from outside. Some people in Togo are doing this. Some people in Nigeria, as I speak, are fabricating spare parts. Yes or no? So we need to just go into industrialization and learn to fabricate some of these parts, learn to build our own cars, and this business will transform. This whole thing will transform because we're depending on spare parts and we're depending on fitters when we can become mechanics instead of fitters. Okay? We want to repair cars when we can become builders of cars. I want to elevate the country to that level. And then culture policy, I think is very, very important that our culture should be part of our businesses. Our culture should be part of our governance. Our culture should be part of everything that governs this country. It's very important because if you take the culture out, it's like a Greek culture. The Greek is one thing, the culture is another thing. Once you take the culture out, you only have a Greek. You're only gonna farm for cocoa seeds and you will not know how to culturize the seed. So culture is very important. We need to make sure we segment that into everything that we're doing. This is just the mindset of being an industrialist. That's all I'm preaching. Please. Uh, we did you. The two of you. Uh, we did in another outside. Uh, we're a businessman. Uh, as some people say, I'm a person who is a leader. And you're Juma. It's in our house. So we're going to do for it in our house. Now, me and Eric are saying, I'm here. I'm in the new world of work. Girls live a brave and was sweeter. I hope the song is you don't get it from strong community member. Make one of the brave one, one person will come and crown me. 
Okay, okay. Alright, so I just answer the first two. The answer is very simple. It's the same industrial problem. Because I'm juma. I'm going to juma. I'm going to be juma. I'm going to be a 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 juma. I'm going I know I'm a person that catches I think that we're repeating some of the questions. It's the same thing, please. I've been following your talks and I think you, when you went to Kumasi, you made mention of renting the sea from Accra to Kumasi, which has set the country much at least. But most of that here saying it's a fallacy, which I think will become a reality. Because from Accra to Kumasi, there are a lot of important or advantage rivers that links to Kumasi. And even the Atlantic Ocean, there is a thread that passes through the Chiman, which can get the sea to Kumasi. So, Yes. Good. Thank you. All right. So let me start from the young guy's question about, you know, uh, dredging and the sea and what I'm going to do about that. And I think the second thing that you said was, what, what was I going to do about uh, uh, agriculture and tourism? All right. So all the three things that he mentioned falls directly into one decision that I've made and is dredging. Now, when you look at the water bodies that he's talking about, all of these water bodies has been lying down for a good hundred years. There is no leader ever that has come to power that has ever thought of connecting the water. The waters are supposed to be married. That's why they're there. Nobody has opened it up to give us a water transportation. I decided, my, my decided said, when I open it, I just take the debris out and I look at the map around the country. Maybe in Suo Debiano, me connect here, me be a cronym, me be a cronym, and to what the Chimana, who met me up and Suo Ivory Coast border, Sahaba or Hua, over 4500 containers, and Suo Pen, the Betimidiaco. And so, 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 and Se mi bie sa en suwa kwan ya. E bi be abe fa ko fori di e chile habe e bi. A wwa hun mountains. A wwa hun greens. Wwa no me bi wwa hwa. Un fa hokrada. E hwa nyina abe abe yed new cities. 
new development. And to your answer about tourism, I'm answering it because that will be a new tourism. Obi to go to so no obi who mountain no obi who waterfall no who farm. I go cry obi to me who and more or more bushes tourism. And to say I've made it easier for you to move around your country from Volta Lake. It's connecting you to Kumase. It's connecting you to Tamale. River Pra, River Tano is connecting you to Cape Coast Sea. And that is connecting you to Kumase. And now one road BM and it's a Munya Mutri Kawa so. Na Tikleta Namso. Na Tiko Namso. Na Uba Namso. Na Petro Tank Namso. One road. Abba. Abba. And ti me Pierre Majune Awa baby. A day a best son or my mamma. And no besa agriculture. Science will not make ano. And no one a irrigation. Irrigation is the technological way to industrialize our agriculture. Now we are agriculture. Now we are in a normal of a thousand hectares. Now we are in a normal of a thousand hectares. This irrigation system will come from the water. This irrigation system will come from the same water. And the emane ebesi sano, ana se emane ebe biemu no. Eno eni, se meka se meba beye roads amama. By the time I mention ten roads, five five on each side, any beauty mempo. And the start industrialization, and I'm preparing for your logistics. It's called logistics. Eho, ena no ma befa. Na ko baby baby baby. Ebe ko kura Nigeria. Ebe ko kura Togo. Ebe ko kura Ivory Coast. Yenya send suono contactor. Na yeti mi industrialize your product. We have become the strongest country on the continent. We will become the number one supplier, the number one industrialist, the number one in everything. This is, this is what I came to do. And you will remember me. Because even 50 years from now, when anybody ventures to connect any water, you are going to remember Nana Kwame Bediako, the one that said you bring Mame water in the sea. And bring that Mame water out of the sea and connect it to Kumase. You will remember me. Because great knowledge and great ideas stays with us for centuries. And that's what I have. I have a great vision. That's why they're debating the topic. Because I'm more crying, I try my dreams to say, ah, now do we cry in a young dream? I try my dreams, I feel you're seeing it. And so I'm more Dubai, I'm more more England, I'm more more Pakistan, Egypt, I'm more more 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 I'm more Water sports. Nini na aya dredging. Enti gana mesremo. Baby aya dunu yesu sha. Yawa mrewa yenim. Mama mai mpeni phone dada yeye. Enkwa ni binswa dunu yeye nko tungete. Say enti mi But I don't blame them because they are not used to development. They are not used to development. I am used to development, both social development and human development. I am used to it. Yes. So that's. As for today, I think the last person asked the question. But his question, the, the one before him is the same thing, industrialization. Uh, Ghana made cars. Again, tries, yeah, it's, it's a vehicle, so we can classify it as, as a car. It's a tricycle. Again, how do you make a car? <laughs> the metal... All those things that is going to go in the car, the fabrication and everything, is industrial. <laughs> but that is just your answer. Niamu pesa mu yewo habi a se video camera o se drums we na opesa odi electric bi share chire ena no ebo boom 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 bi bia will come from the industrialization. That is the way. That is my policy. I want to use this moment to thank you very much for this very very listening tour. It's been very interactive. The people of Koforidia, the leaders, the teachers, the women, 
I will never forget that mother that came here. She's touched my heart today. She's one of the people that is going in my books. And she's going to make me work ten times harder and think a thousand times more of how I can resolve this solution. But you have, you have me and I have you. And I want to rest assure you that this is my 16th regional tour. And right after this, I'm going to prepare myself to do a 275 constitutional constituencies and districts. I will visit everywhere in Ghana. I want to know what the people are going through. I want to understand their pain. And I want to find a solution to ease their pain. I am here for you. I go by the name Nana Kwame Bediako, also known as Freedom Jacob Caesar, and I'm your servant. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. It's good to see you again.